still trying to keep an open mind. I don't want to be bitter about this. I don't want to be an angry old nerd, so... Shut up! You don't think Ryan is famous? Cousin Ryan. You better... Hey, what's up, YouTube friends and family? It's Cousin Ryan, and we've got what we'll call a little trailer reaction here, even though it's not a trailer. It's just a little teaser clip from Ghostbusters Afterlife that just dropped this morning. There's a character reveal. I already saw it in the thumbnail, so I know what it is. That won't be a huge surprise, but I'm anxious to see this. Uh, we'll watch it once through, and then we'll come back, and if there's anything worth breaking down, I'll go in uh, and point those things out that I find interesting. Let's check this out. Strawberry, red velvet, blue velvet. Um, that's, that looks fun. My initial reaction though, that looks more almost like a, a, a commercial for marshmallows, like a, a promo tie-in than it does a clip from the movie. Uh, I'm not, now I'm wondering if this isn't some other footage from a promotion or something. Cause it doesn't, let's just say it is part of the movie. It's got a pretty lighthearted kitty tone, which I'm not completely opposed to. I hoped that Afterlife would have more of a darker kind of Ghostbusters 1. It's not trying to be funny, but you get humor out of the fear, and I don't get that from this. This is cutesy funny uh, and definitely looks like uh, Ghostbusters has got their baby Yoda now for sure. So I'm sure there's going to be a ton of uh, promotional or merchandising surrounding Baby Stay Puffed. Um, I like the kind of mischievous gremlins feel I got from that. It kind of had that like, you know, they're they're out to cause no good. Um, let's let's go back to the beginning. Absolutely love the original score being played here. Um, this the Baskin Robbins. That's not product placement that we typically find in Ghostbusters uh, movies. I still can't tell. I couldn't catch it the first time. I don't know what he said there. Do you guys know? Could you tell what he said? Strawberry, red velvet, blue velvet. <laughs> I thought that line was pretty funny. The blue velvet. I hope we get bags of Stay Puff marshmallows like this. This would be such a missed opportunity if we don't. And that's what this almost feels like it's a commercial for, or a promo. There's a lot going on in this little clip right here. So you see the guys on the little uh, skewer that are about to be roasted. You've got the one up here on top that's drooling. And the other one you just catch real quick before the scene starts is melting into the grate of the barbecue. And I don't know what is going on over here. These guys are fighting or something. But I like this. I love the, the blowtorch, you know, melting the chocolate over him like a s'more. That's pretty cool. It's funny. I'm still like, I love this, but I'm, I'm, I'm just a little hesitant to just go, oh my gosh, this is amazing. It, I think this will fit in the movie as long as we have some other darker tones, and it feels like we'll probably get that based on the other trailer. Um, again, this looks more like a promotional tie-in than it does a clip from the movie. And the piano. The piano is awesome. So... 
I like it. Like I said, I'm not sure where they're going with this. I'm not sure what the intent is with that. I mean, it sounds like it's a clip from the movie, but again, I just can't pull myself away from the fact that it feels like it's promotional, like a commercial. Um, but who knows? Uh, it looked like he was walking through a Walmart, so I'm sure Walmart will get, you know... I don't know if that'll be a product tie-in or not. It seems like Walmart's always got the Ghostbuster merchandise, is, I guess is where I'm headed with this. Um, yeah, I'm not... I think it looks fun. I think it looks fun. I'm not like, oh my gosh, I can't believe this. This is amazing. It just looks fun. It looks like something out of the real Ghostbusters uh, a little bit. I think that's where it's more towards the cartoony side, which I know that was a complaint about Ghostbusters too for a lot of people back then. Still trying to keep an open mind. I don't want to be bitter about this. I don't want to be an angry old nerd. So I'm going to say I'm still excited. I'm looking forward to this movie. I think it's going to be fun. And I'm on the hunt for the Ghostbuster cereal. That is out now in stores. Excuse me, apparently it's shown up at Kroger's. We don't have Kroger's around here in Northern California. But I'm sure it'll show up at Walmart eventually. And uh, we'll get to review it here on the channel. So thank you guys for hanging out with me and checking out this clip from Ghostbusters Afterlife or promo clip or whatever you want to call it. Um, and until next time, be excellent to each other. You know, sir, it's Cousin Ryan on the Hollywood Boulevard. You know, sir, it's bigger than any superstar. All of us meet you some, some real to a bar. Show them sweeter than any chocolate bar. Boom! Hey.